Thank you for purchasing an MI Windows and Doors product. We hope you find these instructional videos helpful. Please understand that these videos have been developed to assist the do-it-yourselfer perform minor repairs to their window product. These do not supersede any of the manufacturer's written instructions or warnings. Please refer to our Warnings and Precautions Guide located on our website before attempting any repair. In this training session, we're going to show you how to change a coil balance. The tools needed would be a flat screwdriver, a Phillips screwdriver, and a screw gun. Also, safety glasses. You do that by first removing the sash. We're going to unlock the sash, tilt it in like you're going to clean it, and then lift up on one side and then the other and lift it out of the opening. Now if this was a single hung, you'd be ready to change that coil balance. This is a double hung, so we're going to remove the top sash as well, and we'll change one of the top sash balances. Using a flat screwdriver, you would place it into the balance shoe Turn the cam from a U-shaped position to a C-shaped position. This takes the brake off of it and now you have tension and you can slide that up to the center of the jam. That will relieve the tension on the balance. At this point we're going to remove the two screws that are in the detent clip. This is a detent clip so we want to remove it. Remove both screws hanging on to the detent clip. You want to remove the detent clip. You may need a screwdriver to get underneath it. There will be two bushings behind this clip. You want to remove the bushings as well. At this point, you want to line this coil balance up with the notch here in the main frame of the window and just get under it with a screwdriver and give it a pry. In installing a new coil balance, you would just reverse the procedure here. You place the coil into that jam, lining it up with the notch. You may have to compress this spring a bit. And you press it back into the jam. At this point, you line up the holes as best you can. You put the bushings back on the detent clip, reinsert the detent clip, and here again you may have to play with the springs a little to get the detent back in. And then you would just drive your screw, screws back into place. You are now ready to reinstall your sashes back into the window frame. What you want to do is put the pivot bar back into the balance shoe. You do that by dropping it in place on one side, then you can slide that side down until you're able to engage it on the other side. Once your, your pivot bars are dropped into the balance shoes, at this point you would tilt the window back in, locking the tilt latches in place. Using the same procedure for the bottom sash, you drop the pivot bar back into the balance shoe. When you have it lined up level, you just tilt the window in, making sure these tilt latches lock in place. That's how you would change a coil balance. 